Ooh, windy. Yay. Off. Oh, this should be interesting on the. Mmm. 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 Okay. In three, two, one. Action. Hello, everybody, and welcome to World of Rider. I have a uh, first thing I want to say. It's, it's, it's kind of windy outside, so bear with the microphone today if <laughs> you hear all of the wind and such. It's, uh, I, I, I didn't plan for it. I'm so sorry. So anyway, um, on this episode, I will be talking about the seventh episode of um, X8. And I watched this yesterday, subbed, and I don't remember much of it, so yeah. All I remember is the big moments of it, like how the start of the episode was... Okay, so basically... <laughs> Sorry, I'm talking really weird right now. Basically, the episode, it was a laser-focused episode, and it was his... Um, sort of his character development episode. Um... We got a bit more into his past as to he was not lying about lying about the guy who got killed on Zero Day. That's literally what he calls it. And Dan, the Gemu Corp's president or whatever the fuck. The, the, the Proto X Aid as people have dubbed it now, which actually sounds pretty good, because that's basically what it is. I, I, I can't believe I thought that it got, well, I mean, it getting infected would have been a perfect storyline. That, that's, that's how the infection first got started. It was a vi- er, a, vi a virus, yeah, a, a virus, or a bug in the game, and that sparked the thing. Or it was a virus in the thing, and it was dormant in it. I want the uprising. Once the infection happened, it activated and sort of did the whole Ooh, I'm evil now thing, but um, I'll get to the to the trickery in a moment. Uh, so I believe the episode starts out with another patient. Oh no, it starts out with um, Laser's past, him walking in, seeing his best friend dead. And he has to take off the the um, the. Uh, cloth covering his face, and he's devastated. He is so pissed off, it is almost hilarious. And enjoy the dog's barking. Oh, you gosh! <laughs> Sorry about that. Um, oh, excuse me. Mm. Um, and then he wakes up in the hospital, and there's a dude next to him who kind of uh, tosses open the curtain and asks Laser if he's okay, that he was mumbling in his sleep and all this stuff. And then I believe the old man's daughter walks in. He's getting all sort of angry at her, but it's not really anger, it's more like a, he, she, sorry. He's trying to push her away and this is legitimately the reason and I hate this, He's trying to push her away because he feels that she says she should start her own life. Sorry, that was a tongue twister. And instead of, you know, telling her about this like a normal parent would, no. All he decides to do is push her away. That's stupid. And I hate it because it kind of works. She runs away. And so, um, back to the scene where they're talking to each other in this hospital room and he's telling her to, to go, to leave him alone, to 
work, get to go work, and basically go start her life, but not really, it's stupid. And uh, she, she says that, oh, I can work tomorrow, you come first. And then he says something else and, and he sort of heart attacks, kind of. Um, but. Sorry, ideas for another episode. <laughs> I had to take a pause there and be like, huh, interesting. Um, but he, he sort of has a quote unquote heart attack and shows that he is imbued with the game virus. And so Laser immediately rushes him down to, um, uh, GR. I think that's the name. The, the, the place. Yeah, that place. Uh, <laughs> the, the XA and, and Braves headquarters. That place. I, I keep forgetting those two fucking letters. It's stupid. But, um, he says that, oh, I need your help. He's infected and blah, 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 blah. And, x checks, and yeah, he's infected with two different viruses. And, oh, I remember what he said to her. He had said that she was fired from the little warehouse company thing that they were starting. Or, that she was working at, rather. I don't know why I said that, that sounded stupid. But, um, and so that's what caused her to leave. And then she, or er, he gets dragged over there. Oh no, 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 wrong, wrong. He doesn't say that yet. He, he gets transferred to that, or he gets like taken over to that place. And then he's laying in the bed and they're scanning him. And Ek, er, er, uh, Laser's talking to x saying, I need your help. Help me, like, let's do this thing again. And then Brave comes in and goes, you can't trust him. All he says is lies. So he doesn't know what to do. And to that, he was not technically lying in this episode. I'll explain that later. But he, he, he. Okay, then. Sorry, there's a lady next to me. Interesting. Oh, 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 Um. Sorry, where was I? He was, yeah, he, he, he's not technically lying in this episode. I'll, I'll explain that later, but I want to say that now. I want to preface that, but he is not lying in this episode, not technically. And so, um, he gets over, overtaken, I guess, with the, um, with the virus and it manifests itself and of course um, the both of them or all three of them rather go and it's funny because they start their fight inside of the the building and um, before Brave walks in he's at he asks his father about laser and so it like they it manifests itself and it starts like they start they hasten and they start fighting and the chief freaks the fuck out it's so funny he freaks the absolute christ out he's like 
What the hell are you guys doing? Like, go somewhere else. Do this somewhere else. Like, you're going to destroy the place. And he somehow gets his message across by pointing over to his left. Everyone else is right. And x kind of goes, Oh, you want, you want us to do this somewhere else? Oh, okay. Stage select then. And I was like, How, I, how, how, did, how did you get that? From, from from the point that didn't make any sense that that literally doesn't make any sense and so they switched they changed scenes because yeah that's what that's used for <laughs> a scene change not a stage change um and they destroy the level one monster and then um we have he the monster is just well the, the level one monster is destroyed and the level twos because there's two of them split off into different get into the two different geshets oh excuse me i'm so sorry um and we have uh giddy giddy jamba i am pronouncing that second third word wrong sorry um and then the helicopter one, because Snipe has to have a helicopter. Also, I need to talk about how dumb Snipe is, <laughs> using his, you know, sniping skills. <laughs> it, I'll explain, hopefully, I'll hopefully explain later. It's stupid, but really funny. Um, anyway, so, they split off, and then they need to go check down the, oh, and then, so they start trying to fight the, um, the level two monsters, and then guess who shows up out of nowhere? It's Dan, because, yeah, um, because he needs to interfere, and so, um, he, they all take a beating, I think. And they disappear. They all disappear. Um, but... And then everyone goes back to the, their respective places. And when... Um, and then we get a, a scene of... And I don't know which order, because I watched this yesterday, and I wasn't really awake at that time, I think. <laughs> I was sort of like, oh yeah, I forgot about this. Let's watch this. Okay. Um, but it was sort of a... Um, it, it was a scene of... Dan Graphite and that dude in pink. Do we know what his name is? Cause I don't, and I have most likely been paying attention. I either didn't catch it, or it hasn't been mentioned, or something. I either, I, oh, I must have overlooked it. Cause I don't know his name. And I didn't know his name for these reviews. It's like, ah. But, um, Dan grabs the, the, the bugster henshin device is basically what it is, um, and goes, oh, you tried using this, uh, for dubious means, it's something like that, he said something stupid like that, he's like, oh, I'll take this off your hands for a while, and then the guy in pink, was like, oh, you'd you'd use that when they know who you are, and um, he's like, Dan's like, oh, I'll, I'll do something. He's like, I'll figure it out, and so they find where the uh, ninja game is. Because that's what Giddy Giddy Jamba is. It is a ninja game where e each and every slash 
can be fatal, and that is a quote by, or, uh, 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 a line by line reproduction. It's basically what they said. It's literally what they said. What M said. Because he's a, yeah. <clears throat> um, but, uh, what's his face? Um, oh, yes, so, x and Laser show up, and x goes, or rather, Laser says to x like, let's team up once more, we can do this, I know we can, what do you say? He's like, fine, sure, let's do it. They destroy the monster, he gets his humanoid form, and that's when, um... He gets his, his level three, which is gear three to him. Um, but it's, it's, he, it's funny because he's like, oh, you're a ninja now. <laughs> and I was looking at that, like, I was looking at that form, like, how the fuck did you get a ninja out of that? Like that's 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 not how that works. Go across or screw it. I'm gonna keep going this way. Um, it it yeah, it's stupid. He also has a he also has his face on the back, which I fucking hate again. Um, but so he he does he fights with and dehensions. Um, oh, no. Oh, yeah, he does, he does fight and dehension. Um, um, Gimma. But he starts that with, um, who he is. He's like, oh, it's done. It's, it's the, the president of the Gimu Corporation, and he says his name, and everyone's all shocked. I'm like, mm, dramatic irony, people. We already knew this. Obviously. But, um... Um... So, he, he fights... He fights, uh, Dan, and actually is pretty good with his Geshekon Sparrow, which are two twin little... I don't know what you'd call them. They're like little, like, picks, kind of. But then they can... Yeah. Come on, Zoe. Um... They, they combine together to form a, um, a bow and arrow, which is not how that's supposed to work, but, you know, screw it, it's common Rider. Suntai did the same thing, <laughs> and does it on a regular basis. It's, yeah. Um, so he, he actually is pretty good at, at what he does, or, um, and he... Dehensions, he manages to pull a perfect on Dan, and guess what? The man in pink jumps in at the last second with the driver on and the gashat in his hand, and he says something along the lines of, Oh, well, it was nice playing with you, maybe next time, or like something along those lines. And, um, of course everyone's like, oh my gosh, it wasn't him. Like, nah, he's lying again. And, um, as it turns out, the friend that Laser had, um, uh, we think, because of course nothing has been confirmed, we th think that um, Laser might have told him, the friend, about 
him having the game disease and that there was apparently no cure. I don't, that never came up was a cure. It was just, oh, you have this lethal disease. And he was like, what do you mean? Like, this is the, the. It was dumb. And, well, apparently, and this is from, um, this is from Brave. Sorry. This is someone. <sighs> anyway, um, the the this is from Brave. That the friend apparently died, but he died of a car accident. And if only he hadn't told him. It was so stupid. But I I did manage to connect that long before uh, Brave even said anything, just because of the fact that he was still in physical form, and when you die because of the game disease, you, like, completely get taken out, like, you disappear, like Mr. Brave's girlfriend. Um, so, the, 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 um, thing that he was managed to stay in physical form kind of made me think, hey, maybe he didn't die of this disease, because that's probably what didn't happen. And it was true. Um, and then for the for the ending, well, not the end, the, the, before the episode preview for the next episode, um, we see Snipe shooting at the helicopter gas giant monster thing. And it flies away, and he goes, oh, flying capabilities. That's hugely tactical. And as he's flying away, he says something along the lines of, oh, you will be mine. Like, I will have this cash yet. And I, I, I said this to the screen, because I'm that kind of guy. I was like, Snipe, you do realize that you have a sniper rifle in your head. Like, just shoot him down. Make him go, like, do your final attack. Shoot him. Hey, make him explode. Go pick up the gas jet. I'm. That's it. You don't have to make him fly away. You have a gun in your hand. Use it, perhaps. It's like I was. I was like genuinely like distraught by that. I was like, what the? Cr like, do you not know how to use your weapon? Cause I do. I mean, uh, I. Uh, okay, I guess, maybe, probably, I don't know. It's stupid. That's all I know, it's just stupid. Um, and for the next episode, Snap's getting his flight, his helicopter, and then things are happening. What kind of things? I have no clue, because I literally, I don't remember that. I just remember kind of him being the flying guy now because we need one of those. Oh, and uh, I love this. So the, um, the, uh, what was it? The uh, adventure RPG, no, the, uh, the platformer, sorry, x has a robot fighting form. Like, like, that's his secondary. It goes from platforming to robot fighting. Brave goes from RPGs to rhythm because that doesn't connect at all. Neither did the first one. And, uh, rather, not and, um, Laser goes from a motorcycle to a ninja. Because what the fuck? Um, uh, okay. This farm does look kind of cool, though. It's... Uh, it's okay. Um, and then Snipe, who is a shooting game, go, goes from, from a shooting game 
to, to, to a helicopter. Uh, um, I mean, that one actually kind of does make a little sense because there are turrets on helicopters that snipers can use. I mean, it, it makes a tiny bit of sense, but I don't, I, I don't know. Maybe he'll get wise when he actually does get this guy shot and fly up really high in the sky and just shoot them from up there. I don't, it's, it was an okay episode, <laughs> kind of. It was good, I'd say. But um, I think that'll be it for me. I do really recommend this series. I, I can't recommend it enough. Um, but I, I believe that will be it for me. Uh, and I will see you guys in the next episode. Sorry for the ramblingness of this one. I, yeah. <laughs>